Hey, this is Fanboy TV, and it's Oliver again, and I'm talking with super artist Brent Peoples. How's it going, man? Good. How are you? I'm all right, man. We've been hearing a lot about your work. Not just, we've known you for a while. Right. But you've got a great new book coming out, so let's work our way towards that. Okay. Last of the Greats. Yeah, Last of the Greats. It's a new book uh, coming through Image Comics. It'll be out in October. Okay. Written by Josh Fialkov of uh, Echoes and Tumors fame. Longtime fan as well. Yeah, so it's, it's a really cool book, man. It's uh, kind of a superhero post-apocalyptic thing. <laughs> I'm not, I just draw it. I don't do real good about telling about it. But it's a really cool book, man. It's going to be a fun thing. It's an ongoing series. Okay. Uh, as long as you people buy it. So buy the book. So it keeps, it continues on and on. You heard the man. Go out and buy the book. But tell us a little bit about your end of the book. As far as you are concerned, like what has been the greatest artistic challenge for you so far getting into it? Uh, probably just the, uh, you know, getting to design my own characters, getting to design the world itself, uh, different aspects of the book has been really neat. You know, with my work with Xenoscope, everything's been um, already designed. Characters are already flushed out, the, the worlds are already flushed out. So this is neat because I get to go in and, and, you know, say this is what the characters look like and, you know, this is what this this building looks like. And, and I really get to... To, to go into everything about it and, and design it the way I want it to look. And it's really cool and, and challenging at the same time. So from the ground up, this is all you for the first time? Yeah, it's, it's all me. You know, Josh came to me and said, okay, you know, this is kind of my thoughts. And so I got to draw characters and went through several designs before we decided on one, and, and it's been cool. All right, now, now as far as conventions, you're a regular fixture at the cons. How's this one been for you so far? This one's been great. I mean, it's, you know, it's the first year that's been so big. So it's <laughs> it's really cool. It's refreshing. You know, there's lots of space, lots of nice people out there looking around. It's been fun. Yeah, it has been. If, if you're not here, you're missing out. And I know you're not here because you're watching this. So let me tell you something. This convention has been insane. There are thousands of people here. I marvel at the amount of people here. So you must be getting to meet your fans on a level that you haven't had a chance to before. Yeah, it's really nice. I mean, I've had some people walk up and go, oh, I love the Grim Fairy Tales and, you know, the, the work that, oh, I love Sinbad, which which is really cool because, you know, in the past it's been a little bit smaller, so, you know, you don't get a you don't get a really feed to those people because it's kind of cramped. So, um, you know, with, with having all this space, people can really stand around and talk to you and, and talk, you know, about what they like about your work, and it's really, it's really nice to hear. So if you come to a convention, make sure you stop by and say hello to Brent. He's looking to meet you, the fans. And if you're not able to, we've got your website, which is peoplesart.blogspot.com. Make sure you spell it P-E-E-P-L-E-S, not P-E-O. Right, right. <laughs> P-E-E. <laughs> and if they go to your website, what can they find? Uh, I usually try to post up any commissions, my recent commissions. Uh, also, if there's any kind of uh, work, you know, my you know, news about books, uh, upcoming releases, also my convention schedule, which I'm going to be at a lot of conventions this year. So basically just anything Brent. Anything Brent they can find on there. All right, so make sure you check it out, peoplesart.blogspot.com. Thank you so much, Brent. All right, thanks, guys.